Hello, everyone. I'm Katie Rourke with Flora Trends Magazine, and I'm excited to talk with Jennifer Hudson today. She is the Vice President and Creative Director with Alderman, Alderman Company in North Carolina. I understand you have been working extensively with Kuberit. Um, their comprehensive line of flooring and wall profiles are gaining ground quickly. I'm hoping you can provide us some insights into Kubrit from the vantage point of the professional design community. Thanks for joining us. Oh, thank you for having me. This is fun. And how does Kubrit help the work of design professionals? Kubrit's product, it solves, you know, like functional challenges that designers run into when they're working with floor coverings, which is for, you know, pretty much every project that they do. Um, and, you know, while they've been in Europe for a long time now, over 150 years, I think, um, them coming to North America is a welcome introduction to our market because they have a huge product line and an easy specification project, and it just helps us solve problems. And speaking of their product line, I mean, can you explain a little, more, a little bit more about their product offering and how selections are made? The flooring industry is diverse. There's all kinds of floor coverings. And so I guess by design, Kubrit's, their product offering has to be just as diverse as the industry that they're addressing, that they're problem solving for. So they've, they make it easy though, because as diverse as it is, they break it down into seven categories. And so whatever issue you're facing in with your design, you look to that product category. And then once you find your product category, um, you look at like the thickness of the materials that you're planning on using, um, that points you in the right direction. And then it gets into aesthetics. It's about the style of the profile, the finish that you want for your design. And you just kind of go, go from there. It's, um, it's, it's kind of anything you can imagine, but it's also easy to learn. And where do you see the strongest opportunities to use Kubra in projects that you've been working on? I think where they're going to really gain ground, what we're seeing is when that transition piece becomes part of the design process. So the designer's not just doing it out of necessity, but it's like, oh, here's, you know, this really pretty embellishment, this pretty accent that I can work into my design and they have lots of finishes so and styles. So you can, you can make that happen. And what's the customer's reaction when you are able to put something like this together? Bad flooring transitions are, are an issue. Um, and it's really, it, it's not just for an aesthetic thing, but for livability and usefulness. Um, and, and there's a lot out there, you know, if you, if you don't have a resource like Cooper at USA, you, you end up using transition pieces that, that the flooring manufacturers provide a lot of times, which are super limited um, and can sometimes even be, you know, kind of obtrusive, maybe even a little unsafe, like they're too big, it's a trip hazard. So, you know, customers love that it can give this streamlined look and feel and, and use to the design that they're looking, you know, to us to provide for them.